They're taking Abel! Charlie is overrun! Captured a V-2 rocket! It's ready for launch! Captured V-2 rocket! Cook Enemy contact clouds. at Abel! Abel is lost! So today I bring some very good news. All of the leaks and rumors of a new killstreak being in World War II are actually true. What is up guys, Mr. Reverts here, and a guy named Epsilon Skyline is the first to my knowledge to ever record a nuclear gameplay. Uh, but the streak is called the V2 Rocket, and the way he got this streak is by getting on a 25 gun kill streak. And then I also saw Pwn Star for Hire, who is a legend, a veteran in the COD community. He got the V2 Rocket last night as well. Uh, but again, Epsilon Skyline got his on the 5th, so yesterday. But I think Epsilon Skyline got his a couple hours earlier than uh, Pwnstar. Again, Pwnstar is a pretty good player. He's also a YouTuber and a streamer. He's a pretty solid player. I've heard of his name for quite some time now, ever since I've been around since like MW2. So again, he's a pretty solid player. And if you guys want to go check out his gameplay, it's going to be down in the description as well. And uh, yesterday, it was also leaked in the data files that you have to prestige all of the divisions to obtain the V2 rocket. And uh, Epsilon Skyline did say that he in fact got all of his divisions prestige so the leaks do in fact line up with the gameplay so it is in the game but it is a little bit difficult to earn because you got to grind out all the divisions first you can't get this any other way and also according to the leaks the v2 rocket can't be earned in war or private match it has to be earned in an actual ranked public playlist so like domination tdm or hardpoint but to be honest i really don't understand why it's been taking people so long to figure this out like i really thought that people would have figured out how to get the new kill streak on day one maybe like day two too, but I guess because of the server issues and other stuff like that, it's been a little bit difficult. But uh, precision all your divisions and then getting on a 25 kill streak is a, is a bit hard, like I said. Uh, but I think we should have been able to figure that out at least on day two. But the leaks over on Reddit figure out everything sooner or later about the game. And uh, to you guys, that might be kind of upsetting. I know there are some people out there who hate spoilers, but I mean, it is what it is. Now, I do want to see what it's like on the other side of the t perspective. Like, I want to see what it's like when someone gets hit with the v2 rocket because uh, it does look pretty pretty sick on, on the player side but i really want to see what the enemies see like is there a, a blinding light do they all have like this uh countdown timer that goes off on their screen too and uh, just constant cry in, in the in the voice box i don't know i really want to know what it's like for them because it, it does seem pretty pretty terrifying uh, but again guys the v2 rocket is in the game you have to get a 25 gun kill streak you can't just get kills with kill streaks or anything like that it has to be gun kills up to 25 and you also can't be playing war or private match it has to be in an actual public rank playlist and honestly for war it'd be pretty easy to get a v2 rocket honestly because the game goes by uh, pretty slow and there's so much time and uh, so yeah that's pretty good that it's not in war so guys that's it for the video if you guys want to see all the gameplay of the v2 rocket i'm gonna have it in the description of this video so go check that out also drop a like if y'all did enjoy and thanks so much for watching i'm averts have a great rest of the day till next time i'll see you guys later